And bombs a reactor. The kind of person who goes around putting up flyers all over the slums, I expect. Avalanche. Some played he's only had it so good because of the reactors. Uh. I'd never seen anything like it before. It was completely uh. insane. Uh. It was like a giant candle lighting up the whole sky. Mm. Sector 8 was a nightmare. Fires everywhere. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako Junkie, huh? Figures. You again. That hot shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's refueling uh, time. Excuse me. And you, Jesse? I don't know. Figure out how I screwed up? Huh. <laughs> You're such a kidder. Remember the last time I saw a real one? Huh? <sighs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? Guy can change. Has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Uh. <gasps> hey! Uh, the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey, I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering daddy's lessons. <laughs> you know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. 
I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. <sighs> um, Daddy? Did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Let that be a lesson to you. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was wrong of me to put you in danger like that. I promise I won't do it again. Danger's part of the job. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shimmer. Not good at all. I don't know what it is, but my So, you make nice with everyone? Much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. I'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. So, seven? The it wasn't that bad? On it was. Oh, right. And here we are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with 7th Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <laughs> and you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. 
That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves 1500 You're the best. I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. <sighs> It's time for introductions. Hey, you okay in there? Oh. Coming in. But he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. 
If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything, even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. You know, Tifa's probably wondering why you haven't joined her yet. Come on, quit lollygagging and go to Seventh Heaven already. Nothing's wrong. What's gonna happen to Midgar? It was just one reactor, dear. Everything's gonna be fine. Not if Avalanche has anything to say about it. My husband decided to go to the city. Heard's about you. Don't take your eyes off it! And trains and take your time now. Everyone's worried they're gonna run out of money soon. It's a sad day when people get more than what's in the wallet. What's happening to the planet? Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. Hmm. Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jessie put her mind to it. Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them, because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? Uh, Please? Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. So many Thanks. Don't get to and don't worry. We'll pay you the difference job. after. Barrett's out making his rounds too. Don't take your eyes as long as I get it all today. about you and me get a rim and play pin the tail feather on the children's eyes. All the items you can want straight from the plate. No matter your needs or your budget are wide selection. You got any chili beans? Stall across the way does. Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? Been waiting for you to... Wait, who is he? Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look?
Thanks. If you're ever in the market for anything else, drop on by. Especially if Teeth is with you. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. Take a look around if you want. Regular. Stock up here and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Clan Lady is a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please. Imagine if rich people start thinking it's apparently it was done by a terrorist group <laughs> called Avalanche. Nothing to report. Maintaining surveillance. Hey Marl. Got some filters for ya. Tifa! My dear dear girl! Oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. You'd better not cause Tifa any heartache. Don't you still have work to do? Well, go on then. Get back to it. You'd have more color in your cheeks if you went to bed earlier. So they blew up a reactor so they could save the planet? That landlady Marl's Marl. great. She, she helped get me set up back in the day. You've been here a while now? Five years, give or take. But never mind that. We've got to get you your money. Last stop is the weapons store. Don't try anything funny or you'll get it. The kids seem to think you're pretty cool. You here for the filter? <sighs> That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted-ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? <sighs> Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor. Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the Neighborhood Watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top.
No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Speak with our friendly staff to find the perfect weapon for you and your needs. Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk-ass bitch like you! Get on out of here! Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk-ass bitch like you! Get on out of here! I wonder. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Speak with our friendly staff to find the perfect weapon for you and your... Gotta do something about the monsters on Scrap Boulevard. I'll head on down there first thing tomorrow. Not alone, you won't. Huh? Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, uh, hey, Cloud. Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh, lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the Watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in kill, but we'll work something out. For example... Aha! What about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine just the way it is. What? You some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on. At least let me show you how it's done. All set? Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Merc in town. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. No. I've got this. But you don't know the way, do you? We are. 
<laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. Let me have a look at your sword when you get back, huh? Won't be anyone who doesn't know about the new Merc when we're through. out west. Past the barricades supposed to keep the monsters out. Anyway, we should prepare just in if case. Any harm comes to her. Here's Scrap Boulevard. I can see why monsters would feel right at home. And the more we pile up, the more they show up. And there's our first <laughs> challenger. Show me what you've got, Cloud. what a soldier looks like in action. This was just a warm-up. <laughs> I'll bet. Let's keep at it. That's that. in like it's nothing? You too. It's a little surprising. Well, I've been here five years now. If you don't look out for yourself, no one else will. By the way, that one's gonna be on the test. This a lesson? Gotta learn if you're gonna stick around. Let's wrap this up. I think that might be the last of them. They won't stay gone for long. Of course not. Even so, folks will be grateful for the peace and quiet in the meantime. A win's a win, you know? True. Trust me, it'll do wonders for your rep. Right. Let's go check in with Biggs and Wedge.
wonder. Think there's any way they can make our guns a little bit lighter? I could always ask the arms dealer's dad about it. Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk ass bitch like you! Get on out of here! I might have dinner at 7th Heaven tonight. Yes, enjoy yourselves. should be safe you guys are machines good job meanwhile we told everyone we could about you so I heard I've got to ask though what did you tell them it's all right all you got to do is keep up the good work it'll pay off soon enough I promise how's the sword by the way good glad to hear it seems like the perfect fit for you yeah. We've been through a lot. Oh. You okay? I'm fine. Been meaning to ask. After you left the village... It's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! Oh, uh, no you won't. What? Run along now, you two. Sorry, Go on. maybe uh. next time. Huh? No fair! Uh, think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. Uh. <sighs> hey, before we get back to it, why don't you check out the weapons? No need. Come on, the dealer's probably heard all about you by now. Might treat you better. I don't know about that. Go on now, get. You don't want to give Wedge an opening. Everybody's talking about, am I right? Yeah. I knew it! 
So, the board here tracks how many monsters folks have taken down, right? A bigger number means a safer town, and who wouldn't want that? Just between you and me, though, they're pretty much all your kills. Cool, huh? Anyway, keep up the good work. We'll try to make it worth your while. Just keep doing what you do best. We'll see that you're rewarded for it. I promise. Searching for candidates. Hey, you just opened up shop in the area, didn't you? Doesn't look that. Don't try anything funny or you'll get it. Kids seem to think you're pretty cool. That's where the watch guy Biggs lives, right? Heard he's like a major meat. That's that person. Hold up. Heard there's a merc that'll take on any monster. You the man? Word spreads fast around here. What if I am? Sorry about before. I get antsy when business is slow. <sighs> Man in your line of work needs weapons, no? Why not try that one on for size? Yours on the house. Badass like you rocking my weapons is good advertising. Think about it. Fine. Or if you want to take a look at something else. Just a look. Don't be a stranger! Since you've got yourself a new weapon, let's see if we can't put it to good use. Come on, let's go chat up Weimer. Who? The guy who tracks all the requests that come to the watch. You never know. Could toss some work your way. Where's he at? Oh, he should be back at the office by now. Funny or you'll get it. The kids seem to think you're pretty cool. Searching for candidates. You're our go-to monster slayer now. I can finally sleep at Searching night. for candidates. Ah, oh, hey there, Tifa. You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, uh, you don't say. Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Your clients can fill you in on the details. Prove yourself with these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some more. Thanks. Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. Sizable weapon. Excellent cardiovascular health and impressive lung capacity. Perfectly balanced muscle and bone structure. 
an optimal candidate. My name is Chadley. I'm an intern for Shinra's Research and Development Division. I hope you'll be interested in helping me with my research. Please accept this as a down payment. I would like you to set that assessed materia in your equipment and use it to gather intelligence in battle. This data will help me to develop new types of materia. I'm not interested in working for Shinra. You should know that I work actively to undermine Shinra's efforts. I'm sure you of all people can appreciate the tremendous power of materia, as well as how it might be wielded against your corporate enemies. And if you later decide that I am not worthy of your trust, you can do what you do best. I will hold you to that. Excellent! Then we shall work together so long as you deem fit. Once you've completed your task, please return and report to me. Please set the orb of assessed materia to your equipment and use it to gather battle intel. Do me proud now, and I just might have more work for you later. Please set the orb of assessed materia to your equipment and...
Please set the orb of assessed materia to your equipment and use it together. You're gonna have to talk to your clients if you want all the details. I hear you so sore. Come on, you guys! Let's get these numbers up! Keep your own town safe. Next item on the Friends of Freshness and Gentleness. Hey, where'd you get? Oh, hey there. Uh, is Marlene with you? No. Oh, okay. I was kind of hoping she could help me find my friends. I know someone who can help you. This guy right here. Really? Okay, let me tell you all about them. They have long arms and legs, and they're a little skinny. They like places where there's food. And nice people will give them treats when they ask. And small spaces. Oh yeah, and they're all cats. I'm looking for cats? They're friendly, so if you call them, they'll come running. All three of them. Find my friends, please. They love crowded places, like the road to the station. A lot of people stop to play with them there. What's the Call us if you see trouble. Hey, Miss Lockhart, who's that guy in oh, We got it. Is it just me? Hey, what are you doing in there? Come on out. What's gonna happen to Midgar? It was just one reactor, dear. Everything's gonna be Hey, fun. what are you doing in there? Come on out. Hey, what are you doing in there? Come on out. Quality product makes a huge difference. I'm trying to get a cat to come out. It snatched one of my pastries and scurried in there. Will you be a deer and lend me a hand? Hmm, looking good. Quality product makes a huge difference. Just like that. This sucks. of chasing this little guy around. Betty's cats might be nearby. Hey, 
this look like a bloodstain? Shops on Culvert Street, stock goods you won't find in more reputable towns. So I was at the Honey Bee. Suppose I could start looking for a car. Chunky's not a bad guy. seem to think you're pretty cool. That's the guy who ran the monsters off the boulevard. Just look at that sword of his. It's so big. Keep your hometown safe. Kill a critter today. The kids seem to think you're pretty cool. You hear someone cool. got rid of all the monsters on Strap Boulevard? No, that was supposed to be me. Hey, it's that guy who will do anything you ask. You hear someone got rid of Don't try anything funny or you'll get it. The kids seem to think you're pretty cool. Come on, you guys. Let's get these numbers up. Keep your hometown safe. Kill a critter today. You're the aspiring odd jobber, right? I'll be in touch. Set the orb of assessed materia to your equipment and use it to gather battle. You're our go-to monster slayer now. I can finally sleep at night. Until they get reactor one back. Gotta admit, the watch. Definitely a cat. I wonder if it's one of Betty's. Oh, <sighs> 